Yo, what's up, y'all? It's your boy, Spidey Studios here, and today we are back with Star Wars Jedi Survivor. This is now part five. So, guys, uh, I apologize if you guys do see two videos of part two come up today. It's because I was having a weird issue trying to post it all day. Um, I guess because the video was too long, my system couldn't upload the full length of it, so I had to split it up into two parts so you guys can get the video but it's in two parts so you guys will get part two in two parts so you'll see part two and then part 2.1 2.1 is the second part of part two so just so you guys don't get confused but um but by the time you realize that it'll be well after this but yeah so um i'm now going to try to maintain to just recording up to two hours of gameplay each part so i don't run into the issue of having like difficulties uploading the videos because even when, when I did part two when I did part one I was able to upload the full two hours but I guess because I went further than two hours that's why it took so long so um so the plan is you guys will get part two today part three will come up tomorrow and then part four will come up Monday and then this is part five so part five will most likely go up Tuesday uh if I have time between classes I will post part five for y'all on Tuesday um, and then part six, seven, and so on and so forth. So, without further ado, we're going to continue. So last we left off, we found uh, Dagangara, Dagangara, I believe is his name, where we accidentally released him from his prison, and he managed to put in put work on us. He was kicking our ass for a second, and he managed to escape with the Daxian brood, Ravis guy. So now they're on the loose, trying to get back to Tenelor was their planet and we need to beat him we need to kill him and the the the, the haxian brood um or not haxian brood uh we need to kill him and then kill the um the ravis guy forgot which breed he was again he was um forgot what those breeds were called but we have to kill the both of them and then take their planet <laughs> so the planet that they're trying to to they're, fi they're trying to find a place to settle down is tanalore Tanalore could be a place where nobody has to look over your shoulder or worry if the Empire is going to find you. So that'd be a good place to settle. So maybe if we do get there, that explains why Cal is never seen again throughout the rest of the trilogy. So, or the original trilogy. So maybe that's the case. But without further ado, we're just going to jump right in and see what happens. So, we're now going to go find Seer, because Seer can help us. Grease, did I hear you mention curried burrowfish? Yeah, that's right. It's a latero dish. You ever been there? No, but I love the cuisine. Anytime I see a latero dish on the menu, I'm a happy man. Finally, a crew member of taste and culture. Tell you what, once we get to Jenna, I'll make a great Grandma Palu's latero surprise. I'm looking forward to it. Jenna. Okay, that's the plan. How's it feel to be back on the Mantis? Good. Thinking about whipping up some curried burra fish. Kitchen looks in better shape than the rest of the ship, kid. I definitely saw less action since you left. You're telling me. The spice levels haven't moved. Did you cook even one decent meal for yourself these last years? I'm not half the cook you are, Grease. And maybe only three quarters the pilot. Very kind, but the first chance we get, I'm making you a plate of Great Granny Pyloon's Umber Hatch. My favorite. Can't wait. Thanks, homie. I'm glad that Grease is back with us. All right, let's get to Jenna. All right, so we went to Kobo. This is where that weird space planet is. Now we're going to Jenna. Pound for Jenna. Must feel good to get back in the cockpit after so long. Fine. Just getting used to things. Never been to Jeddah. We headed to the city? No, last I heard, Seer was holed up in the desert with some weird hermits called anchorites. <laughs> I just wish he'd pick a more lively cult. We're getting a signal from Jeddah. That's Seer. I sent word ahead that we'd be visiting. Let me put it up on the holo projector. Hey, Cal, check the holo projector. We got a call from Jeddah. All right. Is that here? 
Yeah, as I'd say, isn't this the hollow table? It wasn't talked about before. All right. Hal Kestis, it is an honor. Oh. Yeah. Hi. Is she here there? We eagerly await your arrival. However, a dust storm is sweeping over our location. It is too dangerous for your ship to land. How will I get to you? Master Junda has arranged for an escort who will guide you to us. Wait, she's sending someone else? I will transmit the rendezvous coordinates to your pilot. Okay, I got it. Disembark with caution. Imperial patrols have been seen in the high desert. Thanks for the warning. Peggy made the creeps. I wonder what kind of weirdo she's gonna send to meet you. And the Empire's there too. Not the welcome I was hoping for. And the Empire's everywhere these days. The Anchorage looks familiar, but I don't remember where I've seen them. But I've heard of this planet before also, but I don't remember where I heard it from. Because it sounds really familiar, but I just don't remember where I've heard it from. Rendezvous with Sears Alright. You coming with me? Be careful out there. No pointless heroics, yeah? Grease, have you been telling stories about me? I got plenty of things to talk about besides you, kid. Sorry, kid, with the dust storm brewing, this is as close as I can get. Rendezvous point shouldn't be too far. Sit tight, you two. I'll find Sears' contact. I'll keep Grease safe and sound. Grease dryness don't need no babysitter. Sounds like someone needs a nap. Watching you. <laughs> okay, I guess. He's gonna stay here and watch over the ship just in case anybody tries to break in. I guess it makes sense. I figured you'd I wish you'd join me. But I guess it makes sense. to watch over the ship. All right, let's get it. Let's go find Sears' escort. The rendezvous point is up ahead. I, I, I like the dual wielding, don't get me wrong. Dual wielding is my go-to, but I haven't given the double blade that much love. Let's go with double blade. Let's keep going. If it becomes too difficult, can I change it in the customization section? Actually, no, I can't. Okay, actually, you know what? Hold on. 
since I've upgraded more of the dual uh, the dual yielding than the double blade, it would make sense if I keep the double blade for now. Or yeah, it, it, no, the dual wielding. <laughs> I keep getting those mixed up. It would make sense for me to keep the dual wielding since I've upgraded that more than the double blade. So let's go with the dual wielding for now. Then eventually, when I upgrade double blade up. Stay off the sand, buddy. Don't want to end up a snack. So the sand kills you. Great. So I can't run on that sand. Uh, I couldn't even tell where those guys, those storm troopers were. It's a place I can't really do nothing with until I get more stuff. Maybe. All right, let's get going.
way to go over here. Alright. Obviously this is where I need to be then if I can't really travel anywhere else. So how do I get up there? still here. I don't think that did it. Someone out there. Too bad. 
Still here. Oh, God, I 
stay calm. did it. I can do this. I'm sorry, y'all. This becomes a little bit of down. Because this is going to take me a while. This level and the other levels have been very difficult to figure out exactly where to go. I don't necessarily want them to be easy, but it is hard to figure out where to go because there's so big, vast landscapes. So, obviously we're supposed to figure out how to go over there, but I thought I couldn't touch the sand at all because every time I did, that sand creature came. But I think I, I saw somebody double jump all the way over there. So. It's like a prayer wheel.
Everybody.
give up. Gotta respect that. Bro. Really? Like a scroll. Can't imagine how long it's been here.
Watching me? As per usual. Like old times. Uh-huh. I missed you, girl. Surprised to see me. Very much. I thought they'd send someone a bit more uh unfamiliar. I would not be so quick to judge, Cal Custis. Much has changed since we last saw each other. I can see that. Come. Like My speeder is this way. Your last speeder? Stormtroopers found it. Then we will take care of them. Uh, and it looks like they found us too. Oh yes, I want to fight with you so bad. <laughs> oh, I love that movie. Marin, you were such a baddie, girl. Ascension cable. See anything I can latch on to? You can just teleport everywhere. That's why you're so much better. How's this? Don't get me wrong. I love my boy Bo. Bo is the MVP, but I like I like my girl. She could just I thought you were off traveling the galaxy. What are you doing on Jeddah? Jeddah is part of the galaxy, Cal. Oh, okay. Good to know. That's true. I visit Seer from time to time. Oh. When I heard the Mantis was arriving, I offered to guide you. We must get to the other side. God, I missed you. I missed you. Somewhere. I missed the old squad. I like my new squad. I like the squad we had temporarily. But I have this my new squad. Yo. This is nasty. I'm sorry, this is a gross outfit. Change 
Where's the shirt? you know I, I don't really typically do ships these two I ship Kanan can have Hera and Anakin can have Padme which I respect both but Cal needs Baron I want Cal to be with Baron so badly it's good we should hurry Cal a storm is coming I like the sound of that. We need to take them down before more arrive. Just like that time on Arshadal? Precisely. I'll follow your lead. That's a first. storm subsided, Seer is too far to reach on foot. Trying to kill me? Sorry, I thought. It's all right. Stand by. I will fix this. What are you doing? You're just the first of these. She's just a Incredible. beast with her magic. Honestly, her magic is almost better than the force. You need a break? The storm is coming. Ridiculous. I will rest when we arrive at Seer's base. Where did you learn that? Tathamir. You went home? Yes. My sisters are gone. Their wisdom remains. She 
did say in the holiday that she would be back and she would die in there at some point. I figured it would have been during the game, but I guess she would be back at her own time. Alright, let's get going. Huh, the spammels. They stopped at an oasis. Getting closer. is gone, but it will return. We should never have made this journey. May the Jedi protect us. That's not moving. something, buddy? Someone at Sears base would know what to make of this. It's taken lifetimes to build this place. Now the people who built it are gone. 
I came across the remnants of many civilizations during my travels. All things decay, Calcestis. Not everything. I missed your optimism. It is rare in the galaxy these days. Jedi. Seer says Jedha was once home to many who revered your kind. Perhaps they were. My kind. Oh. Great time to change up our equipment. There's the oasis. Not far now. Know who this was? I don't. But see your mother. BD, does he look like hell? Comes in handy. If that was a joke, I hope you fall. Man. Especially considering that you can teleport. I'm so I am at your side now. Okay. That's the end of them. Stop for a moment. You know, the longer you rest, the longer it will take to reach Seer's base. If we don't stay focused, we may never make it there. Don't worry, Cal. I will protect you. Will you? I would like that. I assume this is the way we're going.
Order yourself for combat. Vengeance will be mine. Check it out real quick. I will stay here. should try taking detours more often. I traveled all over the galaxy. Remember? How could I forget?
a scraping. Something's coming. We'll take him down together. Scratch. Right. 
trees up ahead. Me out? Must I? Thanks. Seer would be disappointed if I left you to die in the desert. Despair. You really think you can tame one? Worth a shot. An oasis! We're saved! Now we have the strength to reach the crossing. May the Jedi watch over us. Are you tired? Just taking things in.
That's right. Okay. 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 All right. Is the base far? Not with our new friend. And now we have time to catch up. No kidding. It's been years. We must have seen the entire galaxy. Almost. How was it? Amazing. The sinking city of Karatao. The Prasaya Cliffs. This galaxy suffers. But there is still beauty. That's the way back. Ah! Yes. These are dark why, times. Why? I help. Just glad you're all right. You as well. Wherever I went, you were never far from my thoughts. Slower now. In a storm like that. It's hard to tell how long one will last. Let's not wait to find out. My thoughts exactly. You've avoided Seer for years. Why visit her now? I need her help. We're looking for something connected to the Order. Interesting. Are you still upset with us for leaving? I didn't see it coming, Marin. All of us going our separate ways. I understand, Cal. But we had our reasons. That's understandable. I mean, Grease didn't want to fight for really. Seer couldn't forgive herself for what happened to Trella, and Marin has only lived on Gathamir, so she couldn't explore the galaxy, but I'm pretty sure she didn't want to go back on missions with Saul and Herrera. She just wanted to do her own thing, which is also pretty clear. Cal wanted to be useful, and he wanted to take out the Empire. So it makes sense that he wanted them to all stick together. Spamble friend, can you go any faster? Master! Oh, 
Saved us. So we can forgive it for leaving us to die. Agreed. So useful. She's so useful. Love okay. Should be set for the night. Sit. Tell me what adventures you and BD have had since we last saw each other. Plenty. Alright. Same as always. Fighting the Empire, helping out where we can. Not staying in one place too long. And, um... I think we might have found something special. A place where the Empire can't find us. But it would mean leaving the fight. And the fight is all I know. Look into the fire. It will warm you. Keep you company. On dark, lonesome nights, yes? But left unchecked, it will consume everything in its path. Until there is only ash. But on a cold night, like tonight, a warm fire is perfect. And the company is not so bad either. I missed you, Marin. 
and I you. I had to leave Cal in order to see the galaxy on my own terms. That's fair. There's nothing wrong with that. Of course, with the Empire taking over What'd you find? It just made it difficult to really travel. Myself. Reflected in all the places and people I encountered. Dothamir will always be my home, but it does not need to define me. I never understood why you left. Sitting here now. I get it. It's clear you made the right choice. I get it though. If these two do not get together in this game, I will be very You can't hype me up like this and not make them get together, please. Aaron? Is she dead? Where'd she go? Oh. Why are you scanning her? You missed a spot. Morning. Why are you scanning her, Petey? Make sure she was The weather has cleared. Let's go. Yeah, you can't hype me up like this and then they don't get together. I'll be very upset. Alright, let's find Seer. Is that some canister? Yes! Can't go wrong with more stems. I needed more stems. I need to find more, honestly. Well, we survived our first storm together. Yes, we did. I'm glad we got to see each other again. How long are you staying on Jeddah? I don't know. But by any chance, it's a breeze. How is he these days? Not bad. He opened up a cantina. Hyloon Saloon. He named it after his great-grandmother. Of course Nothing's he did. more important to Greece than family. Yeah. Of course he did. Alright. How am I gonna get up there? Yeah. Aaron, it would be so easy to get his teleport. demonstrated great bravery and wisdom in the face of overwhelming adversity. I... You chose well? Wow. Well, I wouldn't go that far. 
The Empire has claimed the ruins. We'll have to find another rendezvous point. Unfortunate. But at least the storm covered your tracks. Come. Come, let me escort you inside. I can't believe Eno Kodorba's alive. Wow, I thought he was dead or something. It was just a mystery we were never going to solve. He's actually alive. Wow. I'm surprised BD was Master Cordova, did you find this defo? Only faint traces of their passage heading deep into the unknown regions. Oh, sorry to hear that. As it goes. Ultimately, that failure inspired me to seek out other Jedi survivors. That search led me back to my old apprentice. How have you been very captive? That doesn't sound good. I've had a few scrapes, but I'm still breathing. And I'm glad for it. I heard some news about a Jedi terrorist on Coruscant, you know, long ago. You were on Coruscant? Now you can fly the Mantis inside. Jesus. Well, the Mantis looks like it's seen better days. You should see the other guys. Must we keep see a wing? I'm just I'm just still shocked. I'm Don't coming. You have to see I'm just surprised that that you know Kodorba is alive. Like I thought he was dead. Or it was like his death was just a mystery we weren't gonna solve. He was just missing out there or something. Maybe maybe the sequel would have been finding him. But no, he's just alive, chilling with Seer here in Jada. Alright, let's go. The space is well hidden. Yes. Well, the Empire's presence has grown right. these past years. They are much too strong to fight directly, but we do what we can. That's fair. We've been trying to do that. It is critical, of course, that our work remains secret. Yeah. What work exactly? Mm, better to ask Seer yourself. Meanwhile, Marin and I will greet our new arrivals. So, how was the desert? Cold, stormy, and too many Imperials. Eno Kodorba. Back from an unsuccessful journey to locate the Cepho, Eno Kodorba has returned to his former apprentice's side, determined to aid her, however. Mm, not my preferred weather forecast. But more common by the day. Where did you weather the storm? A cave past the old market. Our spammel friend showed us the way. You have a habit for making new friends wherever you go. A survival instinct, perhaps. I intercepted some Imperial communications. Your reputation is growing. Was there fear in their voices? Quite a bit, yes. Good. How are you feeling? Better. The tea you brought me was wonderful. Uh, can we see them? Are y'all gonna open the door? Controls must be elsewhere. Of course. Even in this place. Alright. I think this is the way we're supposed to go. I'll catch up. It's no time to see her. Jetta. I knew the storm wouldn't deter you. It's been a minute. You're rebuilding the temple archives. Oh. We're trying. As long as this knowledge remains, the legacy of the Jedi survives. That's true. It's incredible. Hmm. But something tells me there's more to this than just hollow books. Yes. We're a part of a network. 
known as the Hidden Path. Oh? We provide safe passage and new identities to those oh. who have been persecuted by the Empire. That's the same thing. Hunted by the um, Empire, like, like Jedi survivors? Yeah. Very few of us remain. It's the same thing but that yes. in Obi-Wan Kenobi show and that that dude was doing. And those who help them. Cool. Why didn't you tell That's me? That's a nice little tie-in. <laughs> you never asked. Besides, I hear you've been busy making yourself the Empire's most wanted. I wanted to prove to the galaxy that the Empire is an invulnerable. That you can resist. That you have to fight if things are going to get better. But then they just listen to the propaganda and they pretend they're free anyways. Hmm. You chose a hard path. And it hasn't made a difference. No. While the Empire has trained its eyes on you, we've been able to build the network. Find let's allies. Let's hope. And save lives. They focus too much focused on me that they allowed everybody else when to get what you just given up. I was wrong. Cal, you were just a child when they sent you off to war. You know, there was a time when I remember that the Jedi were more than just weapons yeah. but we both have our roles to play in this struggle yeah, but that's why i'm here seer well you get a load of this hey uh, seer you can't say it ain't short of personality <laughs> but kind of creepy though <laughs> well it's good to see you too grease <laughs> <laughs> well okay. hello baby okay 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 <laughs> So, how was your time in the desert? The storm covered our tracks, but the Empire destroyed one of your speeders. It's a small price to pay for everybody's safe arrival. And who's this? This is Bodokuna. He's a friend. It's so nice to finally meet you. Uh, it's hunk of trouble! <laughs> hey! We're all together! Huh? We are. Yes. Now brings you all the Jetta. We're searching for a lost planet. Tantalor, you ever heard of it? It's on the other side of a deadly nebula called the Kobo Abyss. Well, our archives are far from complete, but I'm sure Master Cordo was up to the task. With pleasure. The trouble is, we're not the only ones looking for this place. I knew this was sounding too easy. The guy's name is Dagon Gera. He was a Jedi. Now he leads a band of raiders on the Outer Rim. There's no temple there. Dagon intends to reclaim it. A Jedi temple out of the reach of the Empire could mean that there's information there that we don't have in the archive. I believe I have something. <laughs> oh, you're too kind, BD. <laughs> I'll start with the bad news. Oh, well, boy. This guy knows his audience. Uh -huh. I found no information related to crossing the Kobo of this. Of However, I found two mentions of this Dagon Gera. Okay. He had a retreat on Kobo. The record show him frequently visiting a laboratory on its moon. Okay, we'll check him out. Okay. If you find anything, bring it to me. I am happy to assist further. Thank you. Okay. Both of you. You're welcome, Cal. I hope you find what you're searching for. May the Force be with you. And with you. I like the squad we got. This squad, I much prefer. I do like the other squad that we had, though, but I like this one. All right. Oh, we got. So we can either. Go I will escort you mountains. back to the mantis. So you're not joining us? I cannot. Ah, oh, damn it! I would have liked it if you did. Ah. Uh, Sierra Junda, surrounded by her loyal. Acarites. Seer Agenda intends to rebuild the Jedi Archive. Seer understands the roots of Cal's relentless fighting against the Empire, but she's chosen a different path to preserve the Order's teaching, as well as safeguarding the next generation of Jedi sensitives through the, the hidden path. So where are we headed first? Back to Kobo? Or its moon? 
Uh, so we can either go to the retreat or the moon. Uh, I say we check out the moon. Let's hit the moon laboratory first. All right. Maybe we can find something there to help us cross the abyss. Yeah, I think it makes more sense to go to the moon first. So we can choose either or of those locations. Uh, Let's stop. Cordova said he found you while he was seeking other Jedi survivors. Yes. Hard to believe that fate brought us together once again after all this time. Could have used that luck when we were hunting for the Holocron. Right. I know. Luck or fate. I'm just happy my master is alive and here with us. Yeah. And determined as ever to tend to the Jedi legacy and resist the Empire. Cal, I was hoping we could speak about something. So? There is a site, quite an ancient one at that, in the northern desert. I visited it during my early days on Jeddah, before the Empire's presence grew. What kind of site? One built by those who revered Force users. We know little about them, but I found the experience quite fascinating. Perhaps you will too. I'll check it out. Side missions on different planets to go to. Sister, then perhaps you will explain to me the paradox of the thin book. Oisin explores the antinomy of enlightenment. It's a paradox about the inevitability of cycles. Mm. Explain. Enlightenment is defined as cycle breaking, but per the canons, to be enlightened is just to suffer the cycle. The more we strive to break the cycle, the more we fall. But in accepting it, we become enlightened. <laughs> It's okay, BD. We'll find another way. There has to be some way I can access that. I guess it's some type of like electrical panel. Like... Cordova requested a translation of a later form of the allocution. Which form? The Plainsong brother. Curious. Very well. Furnish him with the latest reduction. It... It isn't my place, brother, but I must request clarification. Let's hang on to this. since I started freelancing. It's gotten me out of some bad situations, and I figured it might do the same for you. Blaster? It's Marin, right? Well, I could get another one, if you think you might want it. Yeah, she's, no need. she's good. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're good. Okay. Uh, she's my girl. The master always frowned upon using blasters. You once said it wasn't the weapon that makes you a Jedi. It's us against the galaxy, Cal. 
We've got to use every advantage we can find against the Empire. Yeah, Thanks, Bo. You got a blaster holder for that? Alright, cool. Now, I'll show you how to use it. Okay. Uh, that's what that was for. So now we have a new blaster, we have a new lightsaber stance. Cal can now use blaster stance in combat. Blaster stance allows for ranged attacks and upgradable blaster bolts. A real stormtrooper won't stay still. Gotta stay somewhere. Uh, well, there so you go. go. No bad, Pressing triangle to black. Oh, I'm just gonna work here. Right. I do not work by hitting enemies here. with your saber right. while in this stance. Okay. Relax, Cal. Just concentrate. Oh, I see the ammo. He's really giving it to that guy. Stances. Blaster stance, dual wielding, double blade, single. Um, I'm gonna keep the blaster stance for now just to see how I do with it. If I don't like it, I'll change it back to, uh, back to, uh, what's, it called? what's it called? I'll change it back to dual wielding because that's the stance I like the most. So I don't have much power. I do have a decent amount of defense, but my, my greatest is speed and range. All right, let's get going. It's nice seeing you again, Marin. You too, Cal. Good luck. Perhaps I will still be here when you return. Hope so. Yeah. All right. This is a smart operation Sears put together. Why do you say that? All this rock? Natural shielding against sensors. Yeah, sure. and if anyone makes it past all that, the Anchorites have plenty of hollow books to throw at them. <laughs> You can see how Sears managed to evade the Empire for so long. She makes her own luck, keeping so much of her power held back to achieve a larger goal. Yeah, there's definitely more to her than meets the eye. You two have that in common. I can't believe Master Cordova's really here. All that time following in his footsteps. I have enjoyed getting to know him. I've never met a Jedi with a better sense of humor. You've only met me and Seer. Right? That's right. Okay. Keep your eyes out for the Empire. Oh, ah, that sucks. Marin won't be joining us. I guess it's only Bode. That's fine. Alright. Let's get going. So we're headed to the moon. We gotta go somewhere. So that's the shattered moon. That's the Shattered Moon Lab, and that is Kobo. So let's go to the Moon Lab. Down for the Moon of Kobo. Maybe those anchorites aren't so bad after all. Did you call them weirdos? They're helping those poor refugees hide from the Empire. Is that right? Yeah. Who you want to do? Seems like you've got a nice crew. Do I? So, Gordova thinks we'll find out. Let me, uh, upgrade the lightsaber stands for the blaster. Am I fighting lunge? Flying lunge? Oh. Hold square to close the distance to your enemy with a leaping thrust.
ergonomic and effective. Not your typical blaster. Not messing with this. Wade has a nice balance. Think this could work? Let's see. Optimistic. Hmm. Hey, you want to do me a favor? Cut it out. You're giving me a stomach ache. Sure, it's not your cooking. <laughs> what was that? We're almost there. Local city moon's haunted. So I hope you guys enjoyed my playthrough of this part part five of Star Wars Jedi Survivor. If you guys do, let me know in the comments down below what your favorite part of this part playthrough was. Curious to hear you guys' thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. Drop a like on the video for your boy. Hit the subscribe button. Be part of the community. Hit bell notifications so you guys know when I show post next. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.